Hello my lovelies and welcome back to my channel. So today I have another Zara haul. I actually just filmed a Zara haul and uh, as I was finishing up the parcel man came and delivered my other Zara parcel so I thought right let's just film it now whilst it's still hot on the website and hopefully everything is still in stock for you all. So I have lots of items to show you. Um, I didn't realise how many black items I bought in this haul like a lot of it is just like black um, but I feel like that is just like the winter's thing for me like I just kind of wear so much black items um, but there's just so many nice pieces that I've been after for a really long time and as soon as I got like the notification that things were back in stock I just like rushed and got them so there are some gorgeous pieces that I'm just obsessed with which is, and it's kind of like I have quite a few different styles but this one's for like my favourite style that I really love to do. So there's a lot of items here to show you, which I can't wait to show you. So I'm just gonna stop rambling. And if you haven't done so already, please make sure to subscribe to my channel and turn the bell notification on so you don't miss any of my uploads. And um, if you like this video, then please make sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you have any questions that I don't know the answer in the video, then just pop them down in the comment box or send me a message and I will of course respond to them. So that's enough rambling, let's just get on into it. Okay, so the first item which I was absolutely buzzing about, but I'm a bit disappointed about now, which I will tell you why, is this gorgeous, like, um, sleeveless blazer, kind of like waistcoat vibe jacket, which I really like. However, this is the button that came on the jacket, and obviously it fell off. As soon as I put it on, the button fell off. Like, when you look at the thread where it was, it doesn't even look like it was like sewn on properly like there's no hole where that thread came from so yeah i think that was poorly put on um so that's like my only like critique other than that i think it is really really pretty and i do actually really like this button i think it's really nice like this gorgeous like dark tortoiseshell kind of vibe with like the gold um detailing but i thought this was really nice it's quite like lower cut than i thought but i thought with like nice little score or some shorts it would just look really really nice and like like you've made loads of f and i just thought it was like that style that was quite chic which i really liked and it gave me like chanel kind of vibes and it's like the loafer lo loafer style of clothing that's really in at the minute but i really like this and i got it in a size doo -doo -doo, a size extra small and it went up to a size extra large and i do think it's more on like the oversized it um so just bear that in mind and it was 55.99 that's quite expensive like 46 pounds for a jacket with no sleeves which would only last so long in england because we have terrible weather um so i do really like it obviously i'm gonna have to send it back because the button has fell off but i do really really like this i'm just thinking like i don't know how versatile it's gonna be i do think it look nice though with not only just like a skirt but also some trousers i think you could like style it up and you could also like style it, like open and stuff but there's only so much i could style it because obviously the button fell off um but i do really really like this i just think it's a bit more on the expensive side but it is really really pretty and the quality is like of the actual fabric is gorgeous and i think i probably just got one with a faulty button um but no it is really really pretty and i do think it's so i've been after like a new like a black skirt for a while and I found this score on Zara and I just loved that I had belt loops. And I also kind of love little details, so I'll show it you now. So, this is it. Like, it looks terrible when I hold it up because, like, the chain moves. Um, but, like, this is, like, the vibe. You'll see it better on, like, the try on photo. But I just thought this was so different. And this chain is, like, completely adjustable. Like, you can obviously tighten it as tight as you want or loose it as loose as you want. Or you can obviously fully remove it. Um, and I add it on whenever you want to wear it. You can wear like different belts and stuff with it. But I just absolutely love this. And it's got like a, which um, that's the backwards. So this is the front. So it's got like a slit. Um, is this the front? I oh, know that was the side. This is the front. So it's got like a like a pleat in the middle of the skirt, and then on the back it's got like you know, like the fake pocket kind of vibes. I just thought this was so nice. It fit so nicely. It was like not like dead tight and restricted, but it was quite loose and like just comfy to wear. And I got this in a size extra small, which is my usual size for like skirts and skirts. And it goes from an extra small to an extra large. And I thought, and 
yeah it was 29.99 which i think is a really reasonable price and again you've got this like extra detailing which you can literally add on to anything because it is fully adjustable and detachable and you can obviously add whichever belt so you don't have to wear a belt and i just loved how like different like vibes you could get with this skirt and i just really really like it. i like the length i like the fit and i just love it i think it's going to be so versatile and the next few pieces i have to show you are like styling with this like skirt or this style of skirt um so yeah let's just get on to them and you'll see loads of different ways that i've styled this so the first one is this black blazer now if you know me like i love a cropped blazer i literally live in them i wore them at the weekend just gone like literally constantly live in cropped blazers they're just my favorite item of clothing i have to admit so i saw this one i already have a black cropped one but that's just like a little button it's a bit more flimsy whereas this is a lot more like structured it's got like padding in the shoulders and it's also like a tie detail so you like you you'll see better in the photo but like you like cross it around your body and you can obviously tie it as many times as you want but i just crossed it over once so obviously like it wasn't open um and then tied it in a bow at the back of me but i just thought this was absolutely stunning and again you could wear this with like like flared trousers or like long like straight leg trousers some leather trousers leather leggings skirts leather shorts like so many different items and i just loved it i thought it was perfect for like day or night really versatile and i just loved it and i got this in a size extra small and it goes all the way to an extra large but because it's like a tie one it is so adjustable so it'll fit so many different people say like You've got like a smaller body but you've got quite big boobs and obviously it's you can literally just adjust it to how you want it to fit which i think is really really good it was on the pricier side this was 49.99 so like 50 pounds like that is expensive like i'm not gonna lie like that price high kind of puts me off is my door squeaking sorry i get like a breeze from my window so it always creaks my door um anyway yeah so 50 pounds i did think that's gonna really annoy me there we go um yeah so 50 pounds is quite expensive i have to admit but the quality is there like i can't deny like there is like amazing quality like it is really like nice thick material like, it's got shoulder padding like it doesn't look cheap and flimsy whereas my black blazer which i do actually live in like i honestly wear it so much is like more on like that flimsy thinner side so this is definitely like better quality than one i already have and i love like the tie detail because you can obviously just wear it as whichever way you want however many ties you want and etc um but yeah i really like this i think the price tag is expensive but i do think it's an item where it's like an investment where like you could obviously pay it's quite a bit of money but you'd get so many wears out of it like like i said the black blazer i have now which is like a crop black blazer it was only cheap but i've honestly wore it so so much and i just know i will get so much wear out of this like day and night like i wear mine so much already and i like that this is like a different style that i've not really seen anywhere else and i did actually got get the white version of this in the Cesara sale after like summer um so i was after the black one and i just think it is absolutely gorgeous so i do think i'm gonna keep it um but yeah i absolutely love this so another blazer which i've been after for so long like i saw this in store about like a month and a half ago and then I just kept seeing it all over my Instagram and I kept saying to Josh, I was like, I should have bought the blazer. Like when we saw it in store, I should have just bought it. But the queue was really long and I was like, oh, I'll just get it online. But it wasn't online that I could find at the time. And then I've been umming and ahhing over it for ages because it is a bit more on the pricey side. And I was like, oh, I should have got it, blah, blah, blah. And then I finally saw it on the website in my size and I was like, I just got to get it. Like I just have to try it out. And I love it. So this is the blazer i love it so it's like that like a tweedy kind of fabric so this is like a close-up of the fabric and it's this gorgeous like creamy white color with obviously like black detailing all around and i just love it it's also got these buttons on it as well as like a little extra detail and i just love it i think it literally gives like chanel vibes on a very good budget so i got this in a size small and it goes from an extra small to an extra large but again this was 50 pounds well 49.99 so it is expensive and i think that's the one thing again i'm like oh, like am i gonna wear it enough times for 50 pounds however again i just absolutely love it i think this is like 
I do have quite a few like tweed blazers but they're like they're a bit longer like I get a lot of Zara tweed blazers I tend to get one like every year um but they're a bit more like on the longer side I also wear them for work sometimes because I work in an office um but this is like a mo more like the crop side and I just absolutely love it again I just think it makes you look so expensive so chic I think that skirt I showed you earlier some loafers or like some leather boots I just think it is stunning I just love it. I think it screams like London, Paris, like I just really, really like this and I'm so happy I finally got my hands on it. So I do think I will keep it, but even just those blazers put together, that's like hundred pounds. Like it is expensive. But I think I've got to this point where like I'd rather spend more money on stuff that's gonna last me than buy cheaper clothes that just don't last. Because I've done that before where I've been like, oh it's too expensive, I'll send it back. And then I'll try to find like a cheaper alternative and I'll keep that but it's, I don't love it as much or like it just doesn't wash well or it doesn't last or it starts going bitty. And then I end up spending more money because I have to repurchase something that looks similar or etc. And I just, I think if you spend a bit more sometimes it's worth it. So I do think it is expensive but I do love this and I just think it's definitely a jacket because I obviously won't wear it like constantly. It'll be like when I wear like every now and then I think it'll just last me a really long time I think I will have this for years which I just absolutely love like I think it's just so so pretty and it's hundred percent like my style and yeah so another jacket I purchased I feel like I've shown you so many jackets but another jacket I purchased this is more like kind of like a coat kind of vibe because it is a bit more like thicker is this one so I've kind of unbuttoned it I should have really buttoned it back up but you'll see on the photo what it looks like buttoned up um is this jacket so it's got like all these gold buttons down like either side of can you see that down either side of the jacket um it's more like a softer material it's not as tweed material i don't know if people say what type of like material it is like it's just like a softer material and it's got like pockets on the side which are like real pockets um but yeah it's quite like a he not heavy but it is like a nice structured jacket and I did like this because it's like quite warm like I think it's perfect for like the transitional period especially on like a bit more of a colder day but you don't want to wear like a full-on coat because this is like more of a thicker material especially more than like the blazers I showed you earlier it's definitely not just like a blazer I think it is a bit thicker than that which again is perfect for the transitional period however with that it was 45.99 now I think just like looking at the other blazers i think i do prefer them to this one but i have seen people style this on instagram and they do look absolutely stunning i just don't think i fully pulled this jacket off as well as it deserves to be pulled off because it is absolutely gorgeous and the quality is really nice and i really like the thickness i do really really like this i just don't personally think i pull it off that well but i do love like the button details like look at this button like it's so pretty um for reference i got it in a size small and it goes from an extra small to an extra extra large which i think is really good and again it was 45.99 um but i just think i don't love it as much as the other ones well i do love it i just don't think i pull it off as well as other people but i think it is so so pretty and i think it's a gorgeous qu quality jacket and i do think again like it's like that style that i think looks like you've spent even more money and it's a jacket that is just so classic that it will just last for years upon years um but yeah, I really like this and I do recommend it. I just think, I don't know if I fully pull it off enough. So moving on from jackets, I got this gorgeous top. Now this was screaming like party kind of vibes. So it's this top. I don't know if you've been to see like fully. Can you see like all like the detailing, which I think is absolutely stunning. Like I do really, really like this. What's that? I don't know why it's something to stick to it. Um, so this is gorgeous. So this was $32.99 and it comes in a size extra small to large and I got it in a size small. But it's like a super like stretchy top. Like there's no zip to it, I don't think. Oh, no, there was a zip to it. Oh, I didn't even realise. Does the zip go all the way down? Oh, it does. Oh, you can fully like unzip it. I'm not going to do that. But I just shoved it over my head because it was really like stretchy. But there is a zip in there as well, which is good. Um, But yeah, it's just this like gorgeous like boob tube style top and I just thought this was stunning I thought this would look so gorgeous you know like when you've got all your party seasons coming up in like November December I feel like Christmas New Year's Eve and stuff 
or just like nice meals throughout the whole year. I just thought this was really, really versatile and just absolutely stunning. Like I really, really liked this. I thought it was gorgeous. It's kind of like that tutu kind of material. Um, but yeah, I thought this was really nice. Fit really nicely. Um, felt really comfortable. Wasn't like tight or restrictive, which again, I thought was really nice. Yeah, I really liked this. So some accessories I thought I'd just pop in now. So I picked up, well, I picked up two bags, but it's the same bag in two colours. So I saw, well, I'll show you the bag. So this is the bag. So I saw this bag in store again a couple months ago. And I did pick it up and I've been regretting it ever since. And I did not have it on the website or the app or anything. And I was looking every single day, like every single day for weeks. And it wasn't there. And I was like, oh, I'm going to have to give it up. Like it's not coming back in stock. But it came back in stock and I purchased it straight away. So it's this just gorgeous little bag. I'll show you more detail in a second, but I also picked it up in the black, which again is absolutely gorgeous. And what I love about these bags is they're like the most, like you can probably see on the like reflection of the black one, like is this gorgeous like a buttery, soft like faux leather, but they look so like expensive. Like this is like a close up of the black, the same detailing on the same in the middle of the bag, like both sides are the exact same. And it's just, something's at my door um it's just absolutely stunning again with the cream one which is the one i originally saw i just think it's absolutely gorgeous i love like this like knotted detail on there as well and like it comes with so you like you unbuckle the middle and it's got like two big pockets in the middle and they both also come with a long strap which is also adjustable so you can have it like longer or shorter so you can obviously like have it on the shoulder like cross body which i think is really really nice and i just think they look really expensive they're kind of like that vibe of fendi bag and i can't remember what fendi bag it is but it's kind of like that vibe but it's perfect just like a little nice holding bag i do think they look a lot more expensive than what they are i don't think they just look like a you know like a typical high street bag i think they look really really nice and like expensive and they were only 29.99 i think I'm pretty sure they were what's the price Oh, yeah 29.99 but i just think it's nice and they've got so many like it's so big inside and also you've got like that middle zip pocket as well so you've got three pockets which i just think is really nice and i just absolutely love them which you can tell because i'm not really like one to buy that many handbags but i just love them i just think they're so chic so nice and i absolutely just love the material of them but yeah what do we think do we like them I think I do. I really, really like them. And I just think they'll go with so many stuff, so much stuff. This one's probably a bit more for, like, summery time. Because I don't wear as much, like, lighter colours in, like, autumn, winter. But for, like, a nice beige outfit, that would look nice. But then again, I wear so much, like, black boots and all that stuff. Like, loafers in, like, autumn, winter. So this will just go with so much stuff as well. So, yeah, I really like these. So, the next items I have to chew. Again, I got in both colours that were available. So it's dresses. So it's this gorgeous, like, I don't know how, like it's got like a slight like neck, then it's got a sleeve that just like touches over the shoulder and then it's just this bodycon like mini dress. So I got it in a black and then I got it in this like, please ignore all like the makeup on it because I do need to wash it because I am keeping them. I do just need to wash them. Like do not put your makeup on before putting these dresses on because it gets everywhere. Um, so it's these gorgeous colours. So this is like a stony colour. So like this is a bit more up close of the colour. And they are just gorgeous. Like I am obsessed with them. They are so pretty and they're so comfortable and they look really like expensive. So I saw them originally and I put them in my favourites. But I was like, I owned an order over them. I was like, oh, no, I'll just leave them for now. And then I saw a girl, I think on like Instagram or TikTok. And I was just like, I need them now. Like, I need them now so i ordered them straight away onto this order um so yeah i absolutely love them so they only come in a small medium and large and to be honest i do think they are like stretchy but not like super stretchy but i do think they fit like a lot of people i do think they're quite like they're not like dead small fitting or anything so i do think they'd be quite versatile but again i do think zara should have extended the sizes a bit more um, so yeah, they come to a small, medium and large and they were 29, no, 22 99 which I thought were quite good. It's like £23 for a full dress, like for a full outfit and it's such good quality. They are not see-through at all. It's like a nice, really like 
nice material it's not dead thick but it's like really it's like a good thickness but i also thought they'd be good for work as well like especially like this color i think would look perfect with like you know like little tights and some dolly shoes like i could definitely wear this dress to work um but oh, i just love them they're so perfect so versatile and again they just look so much more expensive than they are like 23 pounds i think is a really affordable price um yeah i just absolutely love both of these so the final item i have to show you which i'm so obsessed with it's another coat well it's like an actual coat it's not a jacket like this is gorgeous it is the softest thing ever like this is so soft like can you just see how soft that is like i literally just want to sit there and straight myself whilst wearing it like it is so soft it's got these two little like black buttons on there as well which obviously you can fasten up the coat or you can wear it open so i got this in a size small where's the tag there it is and it was a bit expensive this was 59.99 so it is the most expensive item in this haul however i do think again it's one of them that you'll just have for years like it's not like a cheap coat that's just going to get wrecked or it's going to look like you know quite crappy in a bit like it's it's a nice coat that i think will last i think that's just what again what i tried to say before like i'm trying to do like i used to buy so many coats that were more cheaply made though you can get some gorgeous coats cheaper than this because i have definitely been looking around for cheap ones i used to get a lot from topshop and i'm still waiting for asos to up their topshop game because topshop i used to get coats from because like, that was like my main go-to place and i have like like this coat but like a cropped version i've got i think four from topshop i've got a black one a pink one a dark gray one oh, i have three and they're still on it and they're literally like the same soft material but I just can't find any like that anymore. But I've never had like a longer soft one. So that was what I was after. But I just couldn't find one anywhere. Like we were more like, you know, a Borg material. Is that how you say Borg? But I wanted one that was like this like soft furry material. So if any of you have like cheap alternatives, then place them my way. Because this is expensive. But I just absolutely love the colour as well. It's like this gorgeous like, what colour? How would you just go? It's like this grey like movie kind of colour. And I do think it's gorgeous. However, it is quite big. I think I might return it in size down because I got it in a size small and it goes from an extra small to an extra, extra large. But I do think it's a slightly big on me. I do kind of wish I sized down, but I wasn't sure on how big the sizing was. And I wanted to be able to, you know, like have like a jumper and stuff underneath and be able to like move freely. Um, so I do think I might try the extra small because I do think this is slightly big. Um, so just bear that in mind if you are interested in this coat. But it is, it's just so soft and i think it looks so expensive as well like i saw, saw like pretty much identical um like coats this i think it was like, like netaporter or something like that and it was like 400 pounds and i was like what but 60 pounds sounds more affordable now but again i just think this will last me so long and it's so gorgeous again you can sell it so much skirt boots dress and boots jeans and i don't know loafers or little crop boots or knee-high boots or shorts skirts like oh, i just think it's perfect and it's also wearing coats you know like you could fasten it it's like an outfit in itself and how cute would this be like winter wonderland or like going to watch like the fireworks or i don't know i just really like this coat <laughs> i think it's the color i really like i really like this color and i'm not sure anything like this because like the cropped one i have it's like a dark gray and I've always wanted a light one, but and that's what I was after this year was like a lighter version. I have just not been able to find a good one. Um, but I do absolutely love this. But I do think I'll size down and see then if I like it enough to keep it because it is expensive. And I think for this price, you do just want to be like 10 out of 10 obsessed with it. Um, so I do love it, but I think I might size down, but oh, it's just so soft. So my lovelies, we are finally at the end of the video. I feel like I've just rambled on. But I hope you found some pieces you really liked in this haul. Like, I really, really liked this haul. I'm obsessed with so many of the pieces. I know it was kind of, like, kind of went around the same vibe and style. But I wanted to, you know, stay true to, like, my style and show that one little side of my style I have. And I thought they all just fit, fit in really nicely together. Um, but, yeah, let me know what you think of everything down below. If you purchased anything or if you already have anything, then let me know in the comments. Uh, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. 
Um, I need to delete the Zara app because I spend too much money on there. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't done so already so you don't miss any of my videos. And yes, thank you for watching and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye.